Have you ever been playing Fortnite and you found the most perfect skin combo you could have ever built and you just wish you could have saved it for a later date? Well, it looks as though a feature like that is coming very soon. Hey guys, Mill here and welcome back. Today we're going to be talking about Lockout Loadouts, a new leaked feature that seems to be coming to Fortnite very soon. We're going to be explaining the feature, talking about my thoughts on it and much more. If you guys like these type of discussion videos, tap like right now and make sure to subscribe guys, I'd love to have you over here. Help me get out of the 100k trap. So, Lockout Loadouts, yeah, it seems as though you are now going to be able to pre-create and save combos that you love which is going to be a great feature so essentially you make your own sick combo you've, you're absolutely in love with it and soon enough you'll be able to save it and keep it in a kind of preset system so it saves you the effort of building one and then you know changing your skin up and then having to redo that all you know what i mean so how is this feature going to work well it's probably going to be similar to this concept made by jazz as you see once you've created a nice combo you set it up as a preset according to the leaks one of these presets will include an item wrap a loading screen a music pack, a pickaxe, a contrail, an emote, a character skin and a back bling. Let's hope to god they don't force us to have every single one of them or anything like that. And according to Hypex it seems as though we're going to be able to set up infinite amounts of these which is great but I wouldn't even mind a cap on this you know maybe like 10 to 30 maybe or around that kind of number of you know of total presets but if it's infinite, all the better, right? The only thing I'm trying to think about is how they're going to implement this into the locker area. Um, maybe it's going to be a new kind of like subsection inside of there, uh, which could be interesting. Maybe they're going to do a whole brand new locker UI, you know? From the concept right here from Jazz, it, it could be something along the lines of these. Fortnite usually get their ideas from concepts uh, and they often do buy uh, concepts. They buy skin concepts from people, which is interesting. So we'll see. We will see. So I could expect the whole locker area to definitely have a new kind of look within the next few weeks because in terms of when this whole feature is likely going to be releasing right now it isn't 100% confirmed however the save the world locker is apparently arriving next update 12.1 so uh, that's either next week or the week after so within the next two weeks we might be seeing the same thing over here in battle royale because uh, they're similar kind of features you know if save the world's getting their locker i could imagine the save the world locker feature being added alongside this brand new locker loadout for battle royale so i'd expect it within the next couple of weeks because leakers say that these files are normally what you expect when a when a feature is ready to go you know you can also name your loadouts which is going to be great because i uh, imagine you've set up like a hundred of them because obviously they're apparently going to be infinite it's going to make it so much easier to find that sick combo that you you set up ages ago now you've probably all seen the concept i've been showing you that's because it's been being talked about for over a year maybe even since the beginning of fortnite because obviously combos in fortnite are a big thing people like piso i talk fortnite and tons of other uh youtubers and creators even you guys playing love combos you know and it's a feature we've all wanted so it is a little bit late in the works but i don't know i feel like this has got something to do with fashion shows fashion shows in fortnite have been pretty trending lately you've probably all seen one on youtube if you haven't give it a quick little google search but i feel like fortnite started working on this feature because of fashion shows but as of the time of this video fashion shows are kind of dying not dying but you know the hype for it it's kind of died down um and you don't see big creators doing it now because obviously season two is released and creators have got the content that well we've all been needing for weeks now but I feel like Epic have just kind of missed it uh, in order to bring a feature like this into the game. But either way, I think it's just a great feature to have nevertheless of what is trending. And speaking of fashion shows, it's going to be great for things like that. You know, you can imagine for Lachlan's $10,000 fashion show that he did a few weeks ago, uh, which was insane, by the way. I absolutely love that video and stream. But you can imagine how useful this would have been. You know, creators, I think they had to set up like uh, multiple. I, I th how was it? I forget how exactly it was, but I think it was like uh, you pick a combo and you do like an emote round and stuff like that that would have been a great feature and for example you could set up multiple different combos and try each one out if one didn't work you try the other try the other try the other you know what i mean so it would have been cool for fashion shows back when they were hype but they still are pretty popping to be fair so I'm excited for this feature. So overall, I think this is going to be a very fun, useful and good tool to have inside of Fortnite finally. It is a little bit late in the works, but either way, I just am very excited to see how this is all going to be introduced. I could imagine, as I say, the locker loadout being completely changed and things like that. So we will see. So if you guys are excited for this new feature coming to Fortnite, make sure to let me know down below in the comments. And as you guys know, I normally give you guys news videos and things like that. But if you truly do like these discussion videos, let me know by leaving a like, guys, because uh, I'm always all I'm all about try new content this year you know i can't exactly stick with for the news just on its own so i want to try and you know branch out at different types of content like these discussion videos if you guys have 
haven't enjoyed your time here, let me know down below. Hop into the next one. I'd love to see you there. But make sure you guys are subscribed. Follow my Twitch. I'm live pretty much daily. I'm not sure about tonight, but I will be live for my item shop stream that I do every night. So come on over for the item shop refresh tonight. Use code mill in the shop. I'd appreciate it so much. And if you guys do pick anything up, make sure to let me know by tweeting me or Instagramming me or anything. But thanks a lot for watching, everyone. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.